gotta tell you something, Tessa. <laughs> I, um... You know, things happen really fast. And, you know, like the clowns and stuff going on. And just... If it's just, uh... You know, this last couple weeks have been... My brain is not built for... Lots of stuff. And I get... Scatterbrained, you know... I like to call it chatterbrained because, you know, it's... Um... And I was gonna talk to you about it, like, on, like, four different occasions, but I just... Things came up, and I forgot, and then I forgot I didn't tell you, and, uh... I got engaged to cups... <laughs> ...yesterday. I'm, I'm glad to hear that. I... I, 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 Are you not happy about it? I'm no, I'm I'm happy. I just didn't. I forgot that I was I was supposed to talk to you first. You know, as but it just everything happened so fast, and, and there was a lot going on, and meetings, and clowns complaining, and bull yuck, and my phone. And, you know, it's just yeah. <laughs> And then, and, then, and then the other day I was gonna call you and tell you and I texted you about it and then I forgot because because of Kirk and stupid things happened I'm sorry <laughs> Sit with me Okay You don't need it. I I, I don't need but what? <laughs> you have my blessing for it. And I'm really happy for you. You. <laughs> and I'm glad you were gonna tell me. You like her? <laughs> yeah, I do. Oh good. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't tell you. Or talk to you about it stuff. I I meant to, you know, I meant to, but it's just chatter brain. <laughs> it's okay. I know it's been chaotic, but just the fact that you were going to, um, that helps. You're not mad at me. <laughs> No. I... I couldn't ever be. Oh, but you're disappointed. <laughs> no. Oh. <laughs> Did you get my text? The um, other day? Um... Oh boy, let's see. This... this happy one? Um... I just see that I missed a call from you. Um... Past. Probably from last weekend. The Something long, about happy? Sappy one. No, the, the sappy one. Oh, the one. sappy one! Yeah, 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 yeah! I want you to read it again. Okay, um... I'm sitting at home this weekend feeling sappy, so you're gonna catch some of it whether you want it or not. I'm grateful for you and proud of you and will never be either of those things. You don't have to reply, just wanted you to... Oh. <laughs> uh. I meant that. Thanks, Tessa. <laughs> I don't... I don't get that often at all. As long as you are here and a part of my life, I will never be disappointed in anything you do. Unless it's really bad, right? <laughs> I mean, I guess that depends. What, what do you think would be really bad? Um... 
one. Let's see. Oh, um, for example, if Zolo, let's say Zolo tried to make a move on cups, I would gut him like a fish, uh, and and hang him as an ornament in Legion Square. That would would that make you disappoint in me? I'd give you the knife. Okay, well then I th okay, all right. <laughs> Um, I, th I think I, un I think, I don't, I don't know if I'm on to something here, Tessa, but you know how they were talking about the book and ocean, sooty ocean dumping me in cups and a, a yeah. book and with the clues? Well, I gave this book to cups yesterday and I have it now and I don't really remember how I got it, but... There was... You want me to read it? Yeah, you can open it. But there's what The page one is what I put in there. But I think there's a problem. Oh. There's a page it in there. my cups. I don't... Should I read this? Yeah, no, you can read that. It's not... You can read that. Okay. Cups, I'm sending you on a little adventure. Meet with our good friend Max, he has your first task. Go back to Bozo and give him a call. Be safe, my queen. So that's what I left in that book. Now if you go a couple pages, you're gonna see one called- a page called Changang. Changang. I left a knife with- a knife with this note. We need to finish... What Benji never could. Chang Gang and Clowns will never be friends no matter how much we could try. If this is the life you want, you need to kill me. You have no choice. Kill me before I have to kill you? She wasn't supposed to have that. Chatty. So, Tessa, let me explain, alright? It sounds extreme. I mean, cause it is. But in the mine, I, I, there, you know how the mine forks into two different, uh, like you know, goes left or right. I got her to go was in this there. Was that one side? That was the Chang Gang side. Oh my god! But that that note means not that I'm gonna go after her and kill her. And not that she has to kill me right here and now, but if she prioritizes Chang Gang over me, that someday that it's gonna happen where she's gonna have to do it if if it's in order. And I was getting at I left her a knife, but the hint was more you better take care of me now. You know, so there's no problems later. Because I'm not going to do it. I don't want to do it. I don't want to relive what I lived a long time ago. And I won't. I know. So the salute, that's the solution. You know? I understand. But you also need to know how this reads to her. Well... She wasn't she supposed know. to see that. I know, but he... Clearly she did. Yeah, she broke the rules. She wasn't supposed... She went down both tunnels. You think this is what caused things to be bad? That's what Sudi's making it sound like. And I know Cup, she's an overthinker. I don't know, though. I don't know. You think it, you think her reading that, she took it really bad? I would have. Oh, my God. Chatty, it, it kind of reads like you have to choose. I had to put it that way, chat, for the spice. And <laughs> I did that on purpose. I know that you want her to ch choose you. And, and... It's... 
Not exactly like that. That's what it, it it's proving it sounds I, like. I wrote on the wall. She ain't choosing gangs or nothing. It's proving her priority. It's hard because it's one of those things that is really not an easy topic to speak about, especially if it hasn't happened. So sometimes talking about those things manifests what your fear is. And it's it's not good. You know, I, I had a, a similar choice recently. And it really wasn't easy, but I didn't want to make that choice until I had to. Between you and Bon Bon. I never verbalized that choice. <laughs> Holy shit. But I think it's pretty clear who I picked. I know it. He knows it. Oh, shit. I think it's pretty clear who she picked. You don't gotta make her say it. Honestly, if somebody ever approached me and told me it was you or Bon Bon under my head, they're still gonna have to shoot me. Bon Bon's such a bad guy. <laughs> And nobody's going to make me choose like that. I yucked up, didn't I, Tessa? Nobody's going to make <laughs> me feel like I have to choose. <sighs> I don't know if you yucked up. But you might have to salvage this. How? How do I salvage this? Well, I mean, first we gotta approach the bridge and see what's on fire. Oh, the clown's got- Do you even know if she's upset? Well, no, and I, I haven't heard from her, and I remember the lot, like... Look, if she got- she came out that tunnel, she did the rest of the, the instructions, she met up with me, We must have... We, and we got engaged, I, you know, it's... You know, it's, so it's... Must be okay, in a way. Yes? Yeah! But it's... Well? But maybe it's... Maybe... Yuck, knowing her, it's just... It probably was just sitting in her head. She is an overthinker. What? A long oh. time ago, I, I had a group therapy session with her and and Gigi and uh, Kitty, and it was a pretty eye-opening conversation about her and and how she deals with things and Gigi as well. But she definitely pushes people away when she's afraid. Yeah. Yeah, I know that part about her. So, I do think you may have scared her a little bit. Oh. So, maybe the best thing you can do is just show that you're not going anywhere. 
What if she and doesn't she remember? She doesn't have to choose. It's not a choice. It's... Well, if she doesn't remember, then... Move forward and, and do better. But... Just what if honest, what if somebody you? what if somebody like do I tell her about the book? If you would like to. I can, if I keep secrets, it's. I think it would probably be a good idea just to let her know that something bad happened. You made a mistake. It was not something that you did. Uh, to intentionally cause a problem. But what if, what, I mean, is it slide. wrong? Is it wrong if I change wording inside the paper? <laughs> it's a little dishonest. Yeah, I guess it is, huh? What if it's for her own good, though? You know. <laughs> well, I think if you explain it and explain to her like you explained it to me. Maybe I'll tell her about it, but I won't give her the, the book. It's entirely up to you. Oh, I got another problem. What's this? <laughs> it's a book. Oh, right. Um... I didn't... Apparently, Vinny adopted her, and I didn't call Vinny. You know? I didn't call him about it. Is that bad? What? Oh, yeah, I didn't call him about it. He knows about it, but I didn't call him about oh, it. Oh, my God. He told me you asked him three times for his blessing, and he said no. I didn't ask him once! Oh. Hey, yuck! He said I asked him three times? That's kind of how I found out. Wait, you found out from him? Yeah. He bull yucked you. I did not ask him. He hadn't either. Oh. Either Cups told him that... I, wait, yeah, but Cups didn't even... I didn't tell him that I was going to do it. You know, like, he just kind of assumed. Well, he snitted to me. I have an idea. Let's see if it works. What do you want, Chatty, you little fuck? Achoo! Oh. oh god. Ah, oh! Hey, hey chatty. Uh, oh, oh, ah, oh, hey you're, chatty, you're, uh you're you know it's official now, right? Drugs. So you're oh. fucked. What's official? Me That's... and Ray is official now. You really? fucked oh, fuck out. Great. Hey, Vinny, I got a question. I gotta talk to you, by the way. We gotta a... meet up. Okay, yeah, I'll meet up with you. A bunch of us are sick right now. And I just got yelled at. <laughs> What do I say to somebody that keeps sneezing? God bless you. Will you give me your... Thanks, Vinny! Thank you! Oh, Thank no, you. no, You're no. the best! Alright, problem solved. He said bless you. Chatty. <laughs> yeah? That's not how you get a blessing. Wait, what? <laughs> oh, now he's calling me. <laughs> oh. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Listen, we have to have a nice little sit down tonight, okay? Okay, um, okay, where, where and when? <laughs> I'll let you know, and but you better bring gifts for me. G you want, what, oh, uh, like, like a, what, a wig or something? Like, what do you, what kind of gifts do you like? Excuse me? What, well, what, you fart? Your excuse? I, I, Let's I, just say me and Ray <laughs> went for a tarot card reading. Oh, okay. All right, chatty, so you... We're gonna have a nice long talk, you little fucker. All right? Uh, okay, um, okay. Just look, call me. I'll, I'll be around. All right, sounds good. Okay. Okay, bye. Bye, Mr. Clean. <laughs> I'm gonna kill him. <laughs> I have to bring him um, a present. <laughs> yeah, well, give him an onion or something. Onions are way too good. I hate onions, and that's still too good for him. Yeah. You know, you stole my trash truck with Wayne and uh, Mumbles on it and made me walk all the way from the hospital to Vespucci on a hurt leg. Really? 
Yeah. Don't worry, I got an idea. I'll get, we'll get him back for that one. I asked him if he had any trash in his house or wherever he was standing in Vespucci, and he punched me in the face. What? Yeah, he straight up punched me, and he said, yuck you, and then Wayne and Mumbles beat him up. It was pretty funny, actually. He punched you in the face! Yeah. Ah, don't worry, I'll take care of that. <laughs> we gotta get him a gift, though. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Maybe a knuckle sandwich. I'll give him a, yeah, I'll give him a rock right in his stupid face. Yeah! <laughs> oh. I don't know if Cups would like that, though. Okay, well... Why was Sooty crying? Um... So I think she had to, or I guess maybe she felt like she had to do something about you in the book. I don't know. Something may have gone south yesterday. I'm not really sure, but there were a lot of clowns that got ocean dumped. I guess yourself and Cups included. And Sooty as well. Uh... So I think the book might have kicked something off, or that, or it's unrelated and Kirk got shot in a gang thing. Oh boy! The I doctor haven't been told able me to figure out the link between Kirk and your situation, if there is one. The doctor told me that Kirk showed up in the hospital soaking wet with a bullet in his head. Shortly after Twinkles showed up, being carried in by Mr. Ratchet, Twinkles was also soaking wet. And then, Mr. Ratchet unplugged at Kirk's machine, and Kirk flatlined for a minute. I think we need to have a talk with Mr. Ratchet. Yeah, I think you're right. And, uh, Tessa, like, I... I, um... It's very important that you're there with me, because if you're not, I might kill Mr. Ratchet. <laughs> Okay. Um, what if he needs to be killed? Then I think we should kill him together. <laughs> okay. And we shoot him in the head and ocean dump him! <laughs> I don't know about that. That's something I actually wanted to talk to you about. Um, I understand that sometimes clowns like to goof around and hurt each other and ocean dump each other, but. I don't know how I feel about shooting each other. So... That... Is supposed to be addressed by Party Hardy at some point here. But it just never happened. But in a situation like this... It's so hard and frustrating to figure out why... They're shooting at each... If, there, if it was for no reason... You know what I mean? That's obviously an issue. If it was for a reason, that's also an issue, but... It's good context. You know, I'm getting a call. I don't know who. 